Okay, so for this one, for Welsh Powell, uh, oh, we'll need the degree of everything. So we know how to do that. We get our adjacency matrix, uh, and I entered all the edges in from the graph. And then over here in the degree, I added this degree because I need to go with the highest degree first. Uh, the formula we'll want to use is sum. And then I'm going to drag across that first column. Put a check mark there. And it says there's two. Now just grab this little green uh, corner of the box there and drag it down to uh, cover the other rows. And you'll see there that it updates uh, using the row and column that it's in. So we're using relative positioning. So here I can see that I need to start with G. That has the highest degree uh, there. I'm using G. And I couldn't match the colors, I suppose. So what I need to do here is color G in yellow, uh, format my bucket. And then anything that isn't attached to it can also be yellow. So I can see from the graph here, uh, this guy, I'm breaking any rules making him yellow. Uh, that rules out him. This guy could be yellow right here. And then this one can also be yellow. So those guys are all colored. And then I need to select uh, whoever is not colored. If you want to keep track of them as you go, um, B's colored, E's colored, G's colored, and J's colored. Okay, so all those guys are done. So now I'm looking for the next highest degree. I see a bunch of threes here, so I'll just select one of those. Uh, we'll go with C, and my next color choice is red. So just keep track of stuff. I'll make them red over here, and then C will be red. And then anybody else that can be red. Uh, H isn't connected to C, so it could be red. Uh, A, I could do that one in red. Um, and I could be red. And just keep track of what I'm doing. A, I did red. Uh, C is red. And I is red. I think I did one more there. Uh, H. Okay, and then those are the ones we've currently got colored. So now I look here over in the degree, and the next highest one, it's tied, they're both three, so you can do it either way. Uh, I'll go D. My next color is blue. So here I'll go blue. Oops. Here I'll go blue. And that one is D. D can be blue. And anyone who's not connected, that leaves this guy right here. So this time, I'm stepping through the colors one by one. You notice that I don't go back because I already picked up everyone uh, that could also be that same color. If there was still some that were not colored, uh, I would step to green and find the highest degree and then look around to see who else could also be green. So we've got a degree priority list and we use up the color completely uh, before moving to the next one and selecting the next guy from our list. So let's take a look at that. Uh, three colors, pretty good.